People always associate chemicals with scientists wearing white lab coats working in laboratories. However the reality is that chemicals can be found in all products that we use daily doesn't matter at work or at home. Regardless of its beneficial usage, mishandling of it will give rise to potential hazards. Therefore, this video would like to bring you the topic of chemical hazard. In general, chemical hazard can be described as harmful chemical compounds in any form that exerts toxic effects by inhalation, absorption and ingestion. On that account, there are countless chemicals for day-to-day -day usage that can become dangerous especially when it is applied under high pressure, exposed to heat or mixed with other reactive chemicals. So, how can we identify the chemical hazards? There are two main tools to figure it out which is known as chemical labels and safety data sheets. Fundamentally, chemical labels are essential for users to identify hazards and safety controls needed. From the perspective of the OSH, which is the occupational safety and health, professionals and the workplace user of the chemical, the important label components under the GHS are required. GHS is an abbreviation for Globally Harmonized System of Classification and Labeling of Chemicals and its purpose is to ensure that manufacturer and importer is responsible for any chemical or chemical product to be classified and labeled according to current regulatory requirements. The previously mentioned important label components should include product name, a signal words, hazard statements, precautionary statements and pictograms, first aid instruction and the supplier's contact information. Additionally, existence of pictograms also aids in conveying information whereby it consists of a symbol on a white background, framed in a red border where each of it is indicating a specific hazard, such as flammability, oxidizing, explosive, toxicity, corrosive, compressed gas, unstable, health and environmental. As for the Safety Data Sheet SDS, or previously known as Material Safety Data Sheet MSDS, it is a technical document that is compulsory to have in every workplace which usually will be provided by the manufacturer or supplier. It contains the information such as chemical properties, hazards and safety precautions. The GHS also provides an international standard format for the safety data sheets which must be organized into 16 sections. In the work field, one of the most significant section is Section 10 which is the stability and reactivity. This section is vital in order to determine the chemical hazardous reaction as well as the hazardous decomposition products. Therefore, users are warned in advanced and extra precautions should be taken while handling and storing the chemical product. Here was some example of incident occurred due to the chemical hazards. Bhopal disaster in India. Savesa disaster in Italy. Kim Kim River Toxic Pollution in Malaysia. So, as to achieve guaranteed chemical safety in workplace and to protect the environment, details on the identity and hazards of chemical must be readily available and coherent for users to obtain and understand. Hence, the two major tools, chemical labels and safety data sheet, play crucial roles to ensure low potential of chemical hazards. Thank you for your watching.